<laughs> I told you the city was dangerous, friend. I kind of like it. It's growing on me. <laughs> nice to see your happy tourist smiling. <laughs> the fuck are you doing here? I came back. I can see that. But why? To save you. Oh, yeah, real hero. Listen. Let's now c come with me, Max, to Brazil. It'd be a chance to play the fall guy in a plot that my boss's brother's hatching to profit from the selling of human organs. Yeah, it'll be perfect for you. What are you talking about? I don't know nothing about human organs, man. Victor and Marcelo are trying to teach Rodrigo a lesson. Get him to loosen the purse strings and the family money. They pressured me into doing it. Do you want to die? I came back for you. I did my best. I'm having a kid, Max. I gotta go. Fuck you. Sure. Later. Now, let's go. I hope this thing works. Everything. No, you don't. I'm sorry I couldn't save your sister. I was there. It wasn't your fault. I was paid to protect her, and I didn't. Was she married into a sick family? Maybe. I... I just wanted to say thank you for giving us a chance to live. I mean, as a family. Well, I hope it all works out for you, for all of you. Thank you. Don't be too long. Well, buddy, that's it. Where are you guys gonna go? Uh, I don't know, maybe back to New York. Uh, maybe down to Argentina. Giovanna has family in Salvador. Maybe we'll just stay there. Me, yeah, I got business to take care of. Uh, I I'm sorry I, I dragged you into this. I, I know... Uh, I, I know it was very wrong. It's all right, it's done. But hey, I'm having myself a fun old time. Maybe this is how things had to be. Figure I... Might as well die in the sunshine as die in the snow. Look, I'm sorry I'm leaving. I, I got a kid coming, you know? you know how it is. I know how that is. You know, I, I almost didn't say goodbye to you. I said to myself, maybe this guy will put a bullet in me. <laughs> maybe I will. But not right now. Thank you. Try to look after yourself, Max, huh? Life is worth living. If you say so, pal. I thought I was going to have to witness another murder. <laughs> nah. Not him. You ready? I guess. Okay. I've uh, looked through this information you gathered. It's not very nice. What is it? It's the Ufe. The famous Mr. Becker. Friend of Victor Bronco. <laughs> yes. And a contributor to his campaigns. A government employee, of course. And? A weapons dealer. A murderer. This was known. A dealer in human organs. This wasn't known. A proper gentleman. Mm, sure. So you're gonna bring him down? <laughs> yes, because I want to lose my wife and my children and then get killed myself. All that after watching him walk free. Tell me what has to be done. Well, officially, there's uh, nothing I can do. And unofficially? Well, we can always try something a little more creative. Creative? De Silva had promised me a 10 o'clock showcase. I had to make sure I was on stage and ready for my close-up. Diga a Becker. Que vim para ele. Ah! Ah! 
Ei, olha aqui. Tropa, tropa. Ei, moço. Mano, o que é esse cara aí? Eu da tua conta, rapaz. Vai, vai. Conta do Deus! Meu conta do Deus, você vai cu, pô. Ela não desgruda dela, meu Ei, irmão. Ei, quem é essa cara aí? Convidado nosso. Quebra esse otário aí. Deixa comigo, me dá uma lição nele. <risos> então, o pai dela não desgruda. Ladrão, filha da puta! Atrás de inocência! O que é que você vai fazer? Você vai fazer com o Tigão aqui! Eu não fiz nada! O que você vai se acontecer, caralho? Tá pensando o quê? Hã? Onde é que você vem? Fica aí, cara! Não posso, hoje! Eu! Se fodeu, filha da puta! Otário! Não, não, não! Deixa eu sair daqui, velho! Ô, ô, ô! Segura a porta aí! Rapaz, eu vi uma outra versão. Mas essa aqui é assim, ô! Olha, vamos resolver aquela parada lá, hein? Morou. Chega aí, chega aí. Valeu, amigo. Foi todo vasculhado. Tem mais o que? Hey! What are you doing here? Huh? I ask you a question. Answer him! Answer him! What are you doing? What? What are you doing here? O que você está fazendo aqui? What are you doing here? I, I don't understand. I can't hear you. What, what are you doing here? What are you doing, doing here? Hit me in the ear. Hey, answer me. What are you doing here? Back in the precinct after all this time. Time to find out what the hell is going on. I knew nothing resembling good times lay beyond that gate, but I was going to have to face the music sooner or later. I guess our little stunt helped some other civic-minded people raise valid concerns about community relations. Their faces said it all. I was on their side, but how could they know that? If they came through that door, I'd be leaving as a human shield and never leave them at all. Luckily for me, for once, the police arrived just in time. It sounded like all hell was breaking loose. Whatever nonsense De Silva had pulled, it seemed to be working.
favor, por favor. Eu te fiz uma pergunta, pô. Mr. Have a nice day, guy. You ain't gonna help me. The last few prisoners were trapped in here, and more presently, seemed I was too.
The security switch had to be in that booth. It was Monday's arrest log, as far as I could tell. And no sign of anybody from Nova Esperanza. All those poor bastards have been checked straight into the Imperial Palace Hotel. Kid had had the right idea. There was no point bouncing bullets off that thing. I decided I'd try to pick up where he left off. And then immediately regretted that decision.
seemed a crying shame to let that RPG go to waste. Wasn't this nice? The perfect end to a perfect trip. If someone had told me six months ago this was where my life was headed, I'd have ordered a double of whatever they were drinking. Drunk it, then blown my head off. Any time the prison riot had bought me was starting to run out, I had to keep moving. Another dark, rainy night. Another police station. Another futile crusade for amends. Time moves forward, and nothing changes. 